Hey everybody, it's Steve. Welcome back to another video. Even if we got for y'all, today is we actually got a, another trade, guys. Now, you know, this is the time when my channel start blowing up. It's because I'm going to keep on making videos on all these trades that happen around the NBA. Now, if you do like how I talk about every NBA team, uh, make sure to leave a like on the video. But let's get into the trade. Jer not Jaron Jackson. Sorry, guys. I'm just looking at Jaron Jackson right now. Just looking at his stats. No homo, but... Because I'm going to say I'm looking at Jaron Jackson. But a trade just went down. Uh, if y'all can see right here, the Wizards trade. I'll put a junior to the Bulls for Bobby Portis and Javari Parker. Now, I can see. Okay. Okay, you know how we talk about both sides. So, I'm going to start off with the Bulls side. The Bulls did get a really good player to play alongside. If you hear a little gunshots in the background, guys, this is my... I'm just not. I'm not playing the game. My dad's playing the game. Just, just to inform y'all. But the Bulls side, they do get a young, not a young. I forgot. He's not that young, but I think he's like 26, 27 years old. He's on a big deal, so that's one downside for Otto Porter Jr. I feel like. But the one thing I do see with Otto Porter Jr. is like he is a good player, and I play. I think he would be a really good player to play around Zach Levine. I know we can score the ball, and of course, Zach Levine can score the ball. So, I think them two together is a really good fit. But that's the only thing we got to say for the bull side. Let's get to the wizard side. Now, the wizard side, they do get Javari Parker and, and uh, what's that name? Bobby Portis. Now, the Bobby Portis, he is a really good scorer. I really like him as an NBA player. And. Javari Parker, he's on a twenty million dollar deal now. He does get a he does get a team option, so um I believe the team, the Wizards, are probably gonna decline his team option if he doesn't do good. But it it was a smart trade for trading him away because they they would send no use to him on the Chicago Bulls. So it is smart to get him to a team that's actually gonna put him to use. Him playing beside Bradley Bill and, of course, his old teammate. Uh, but the same teammate is going to be Bobby Portis. I think it was a great, great trade on both ends. Like, everything helps out. Javari Park can score the basketball with uh, Bradley Bill. So, I feel like it was a great trade all around for both teams. Now, if you, now guys, I'm on the road 200 subs, man. I need y'all to sub, bros. Just sub to the channel and make sure to leave a like and comment below and give me an argument that y'all feel like I said anything wrong in this. But if I said anything right, you can agree with me. But, guys, this has been TB1. I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.